best could we be doing uh, from a private sector perspective? But, um, 42, where we basically have entered into the infrastructure provider, the telcos, are not getting the credit for this, and I have to declare. Be the architects of this future, I, I want and I dream. And the, I We want to invest uh, around 70 billion euros of public money in the coming years. It's also very ambitious from the qualitative point of view because we want it to be a transformative process with deep reforms that really bring us uh, on track in terms of the modernization, digitalization, also fighting climate change. We want to devote around 30% of total investments, that's around 20 billion euros in this first period, to digitalization. I know that Spain has been a pioneer with the ongoing work on its digital rights charter. We want to learn and build on that. As an outcome of this exercise, the Commission will propose a joint EU declaration later this year. Europe must not only lead the way internally. It must also work with like-minded countries to create a safe and fair global digital environment. This welcome, it is now time to attend the VAP. And this is the reason why we create infrastructures. And we think that it is also driving disruptions that we need to address. As we said at the beginning,